Whether this person is trolling or not, let's actually break this down according to iridology because this actually means something. The white, the hard white area around your eyes that's away from the iris is called the sclera. And discoloration of this part of the eye typically means some form of imbalance within the eye, I mean within the body. Prime example, people with jaundice, they have like a yellow or orange tint to that part of their eye and that's typically associated with the liver and the gallbladder. So you'll see things like liver congestion or hepatitis. If you see bluish or grayish parts of the sclera, that typically means circular problems or circulatory problems. Now, if you see it's brown or very, very like close to blackish and really, really dark, that means you have toxins and a lot of toxins within the body that are not finding their way out. So you'll see more of like digestional failure or weakened parts of the organs. All in all, see an iridologist. If you really feel like, or if you notice any type of discoloration and you feel as though you don't want to do the work for yourself and you should use somebody that's professional and certified for it, by all means, get an iridologist to help you out. But it's better to be safe than to be sorry. I don't know if you guys have been watching the other episodes that I've been posting about, uh, not really necessarily iridology, but you know things according to viewing the internal organs via the eyes. Literally every part of our body is telling us something, whether we're ignorant to it or not. Additionally, before I close this out, Bernard Jensen actually has an amazing iridology book that you guys should check out. It's called The Science and Practice in the Healing Arts. Peter Jackson Maine actually has another book as well, and that's called The Science and Practice of Iridology. But all in all, friends, I hope this helped you out and God bless.